All right, well, thank you so much. Great to be with all of you. I'm Brooke Baldwin. Uh, we have to begin now with this breaking news into the disappearance of that University of Virginia sophomore Hannah Graham because now there is word the man accused of kidnapping her could be linked to the disappearance of a Virginia Tech student from a case. Some um, we, we sort of have to tackle two things. When we say forensic link, what does that mean? And two, let's refresh everyone's memory as far as what happened with Morgan Harrington five years ago. But first to you, Sonny, forensic link. Well, that could mean a number of things. And people sometimes jump to conclusions and they let's think, not do that, that. let's not do that. They think right away that must be definitive. Harrington, I remember the story five years ago. Me too. Virginia Tech student in Charlottesville going to a Metallica wow. show at uh, the at arena there. At the John there. Paul Jones Arena, yep. which ne is now the command center for the search for Hannah Graham. Mm -hmm. and now, a couple months later, the top she was wearing, the clothes, were found in Trader, allegedly. Mm -hmm. Let me give you one other thing. In 2005, there was a 2012, the DNA from the sexual assault victim now allegedly associated with a person in custody. It's because I was checking the Twitter. This is one of the reporters in um, uh, the Roanoke area where the Harringtons live, and she had just sat down with the, the parents uh, and the mother. This is according to her Twitter account. The mother says she is relieved after five years to possibly have uh, her daughter's killer. I know they're still hesitant I, for five years she has no idea what happened to her child so it's like once I can't imagine parents hearing this possible link yeah and, and I and I will we realize that perhaps that is why he felt so strongly about it this is just good old-fashioned police work and if this case goes to trial my goodness the prosecutors will have a lot to work let me with. add one thing that Sonny yeah. is saying there's more women that went missing than just these three there are more. It's the Route 29 corridor. Some new information. This reporter mm -hmm. talked to the to the Harringtons as well today, and we'll give us some more information. So this could be could again huge, huge, huge. Um, ladies, thank you very thank much. You. I really appreciate that. Uh, we move along.